I just started the download for Grand Theft Auto 5 on the PlayStation 5 and I feel like this is going to be the longest wait of my life. Anyway, let's get into the video. So what's going on guys, today I want to talk about the 5 Break worst down. people to play COD with, or any competitive game for that matter, I guess, Overwatch, CSGO, Valorant. Anyway, we're going to start things off with number 5 here, and we're starting off with the kid without a mic. This kid's really annoying, and it's not because the kid's an asshole, it's not because the kid's yelling at you, it's because the kid's not talking at all. You don't know what's going on. Let's say you're playing COD, and the spawns flip. This kid knows, but you don't, because this kid can't communicate with you. And when they try to communicate, they end up using like the Xbox messages or something, and spend more time messaging you than actually playing the game. I swear to god, man. There's controllers that come with the console, and if you play on the PlayStation, there's no excuse, because there's a mic built into your controller. So quit making excuses that you don't have a mic. And plug it in and let us what, know what's going on. Thank you, and uh, yeah, that's number five. Please get a headset. Coming in at number four, I kind of want to just put this right next to the other one, and that is the kid with a really bad mic. Or back in the day, the kid with the connect, or the kid with like the little earpiece. I used to be that kid. Don't be that kid. I swear, man. This guy, you load up into the lobby with him, you say what's up, and you're. Uh, greeted with a voice that sounds just like yours that says what's up Threaten and then you realize this guy's playing in the fucking bat cave because you can hear everything that you're saying it is so annoying because you can hear everyone else echo throughout the uh, lobby and then when the kid actually speaks you can't hear him but you can hear everything going on in his background you can hear like the whole wedding going on next door you can hear like the wife getting mad and like beating one of the kids you can hear like the crickets jumping around in the yard, you can hear the lawnmower like four yards over. You can hear everything with this kid, except the guy on the headset, and that's the worst part. This guy, I don't think he's worse than the kid with no mic, but he's up there. He's pretty bad. Don't be this guy either. Coming in at number three, and I don't personally hate this guy, we all used to be this guy. It's the noob, the bad player, the guy who's just not very good at the game. This kid will go 1 in 40 every game. This kid will get zero captures. And, uh, I don't really hate this guy. A lot of people hate playing with this guy. But you gotta remember, we were all this guy at one point, so don't go too hard on him. I'm sorry, noob, but you gotta come in at number 3. Coming in at number 2, 100% way worse than the noob. It's the decent player. It rages, or sometimes it's a noob, but most times it's either a decent or like above average player who just gets so mad whenever they die, especially like in Call of Duty. Like they get quick scoped, and the next five minutes you're listening to a rant about how this guy hates quick scopes. This guy's just so annoying. All he does is whenever he dies, he'll yell at you. Everything's someone else's fault. Oh, it's your fault you didn't cover me. That's your fault the grenade hit me. It's your fault my parents divorced. It's your fault that my dad went out to get the milk and never returned with it. It doesn't matter. This guy will blame you for everything. And nobody wants to play with you. <laughs> that was number two. The Rager. Coming in at number one. This is the only guy I legitimately hate. It's the cheater. The hacker. We're gonna have a whole separate video on this guy. Don't worry. And I will be pointing out names. This guy is an asshole. I don't know what makes them do it, it doesn't matter what game you're playing. Grand Theft Auto, he's gotta play with a mod menu. Call of Duty, he's invisible, he's in god mode, he has unlimited specialist, he has... I don't know, aimbot. I feel like with this kid there's something going on in his life that's causing him to do this. Maybe his grandma told him to sweep the floor in 20 minutes and she wants it spotless. And little Jimmy said, no, I want to play fucking Call of Duty. And then she grabs the broomstick and smacks him in the side of the head. And tells him that he has to uh, clean the floor. So then what he does is he goes on Grand Theft Auto 5 all pissed off, hunched over his keyboard, just mad as fuck. Uh, modding and ruining people's experience. It doesn't matter what game you're playing. I played fucking Roblox in this, and I found a hacker. It doesn't matter what you play. This kid is going to hack. Because 
they can't play the game. And this also goes Ruined. for the people who use like game breaking glitches and stuff like that. You're not safe from this, you're doing the same thing, just without the effort of hacking. So you're not safe from this. But we're gonna have a whole separate video on uh, Call of Duty and this one guy who I had a lot of beef with because he was cheating and I called him out for it. But anyway, that was the video. Nobody likes the hacker. Um, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.